Charlie? Well, one of the reasons our audit costs are so low is we have this passion for keeping everything simple. We don't want to be difficult to audit. And, uh, and we prefer our activities that are simple. If you take the C's candy company, the whole company goes to cash at the end of December every year as if it were a farm where the crop came in and was sold in December. I mean, an idiot could audit the C's candy company without getting into trouble. And, and there's a lot in Berkshire that's like the C's candy company. It would be, it would be really hard to screw up. We don't like complicated accounting. I mean, it, uh, we really do like things that produce cash. And, uh, and, and Enron is a good example. I'm, en Enron's grotesque in, in what happened. But there's no question in my mind that, that auditors have been unduly compliant to client wishes over the last few decades, and more so as they went along, even to the point where they started suggesting what I would consider quite, doubt, uh, quite dubious accounting to people in mergers and so on, so as to make their figures look better later on. And I've seen it firsthand. So I, I just, I think that although the auditors are supposed to work for the shareholders, that they got too much so they were working for management, but I think that Enron may push them back significantly even in the other direction. I, so I, I, think, I think Enron will have a distinct beneficial effect on, 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 on auditing, and it was needed. So it's going to have a distinct beneficial effect on one fewer auditors. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm.